You know how everyone loves to be stuck at the airport looking for their luggage? Well, finally, someone made a game about this. I mean, at last! You know? Of all the recreational things people love doing, this is probably one of the better ones. There is a big snowstorm going on up here in the Northeast, and a lot of people are stuck at the airport, so I think this game is pretty topical. This is a good example of what the people are going through. The plane drops luggage through a big uh, How the Grinch Stole Christmas tube, and then two uh, identical twins try to catch different colored luggage. Of course, when some luggage seeps through the cracks, which might not look like it will happen because it's going by slowly, but trust me, this game gets exponentially harder and really, really fast. Like, this game gets almost impossible to play within 10 minutes of playing. The luggage just gets too far apart and it gets too fast, and you just cannot keep up with it no matter how fast you are, no matter if you have some kind of modded joystick that can make you move extra super fast, it just doesn't matter. Uh, about 10 minutes of the game, into the game, the luggage will just sip, slip through the cracks and there's nothing you can do about it. This game would be very fun, and it is fun for about 10 minutes, but then it gets just way too hard and it's impossible to play. You can just restart this game and play it for 10 increment periods, and that would make it a pretty cool game, but you know, who does that? That's just not, that's, that's not practical. This game is just way too hard to be enjoyable, and I give it, I'd say a 5.5 out of 10, just because it's a quality title, but just way too goddamn hard. I mean, seriously. When some luggage falls through the cracks, all the luggage just sprays uh, clothing, and that, that ends the game for you. Which I'm, I'm not sure how one bag falling through the cracks uh, activates all the other bags just breaking apart. I, I guess there's some kind of... They're connected. There's some kind of bag... Uh, intricate bag ecosystem, like an avatar where everything is connected, both spiritually and mentally. You get about three lives, and then the game's over, and you have to restart again, but, um... And be prepared to restart the game every ten minutes, like I said, because... I, I mean, seriously, I dare you to play the game for ten minutes straight without losing. Because, I feel, I'm sure you can do it, but... It's like, it's going to take a lot of tries, and I don't really don't know if it's really worth it. I, I would actually recommend just playing something else. Just ignore this review. Go play some other game. This game is just not worth it, because you can only play it ten minutes at a time. Goodbye, my friends.